Hello, my name is Mark Cruz of Nikon Canada, and I'd like to tell you about our new full-frame DSLR, the DA-10A. This is a first for Nikon, as this model is designed exclusively for astrophotography, allowing you to capture images that we normally see only coming out of NASA. The optical filter employed by the DA-10A has been made more sensitive to hydrogen alpha wavelengths, meaning that nebulae, which for the most part emit light at this particular wavelength, will appear much more vivid. However, for normal shooting, this can create red color casts that will be difficult to change even in post-production, which is why we recommend the D810 for general photography rather than the D810A. The D810A really shines when used with an equatorial mount that can track stars for extended periods of time. To really show how much more sensitive the D810A is to hydrogen alpha light, here is an example of the California Nebula shot with both the DA-10 and the DA-10A. Thanks to the reassessed transmission characteristics, the DA-10A is four times as sensitive as the DA-10, showing much more vivid reds. Other than the optical filter, there are other differences that set the DA-10A apart from the already impressive DA-10. First, there is now an additional manual mode that's used specifically for long exposures. With every other Nikon DSLR, the maximum shutter speed that can be selected is 30 seconds. But with the DA-10A, you can go all the way up to 900 seconds, which is 15 minutes long. This is great for compositing multiple photos that were shot at very long exposures, such as this shot of the Horsehead Nebula which was created using eight shots, all from 600 second long exposures. Another feature on the Nikon DA-10A is the new brighter preview screen when using live view and shutter speeds longer than 30 seconds. With a normal Nikon DSLR, many astrophotographers find that the live view image looks too dark for them to compose or focus effectively. So, when using a shutter speed longer than 30 seconds, the DA-10A will now show a much brighter image. There are also a number of astro-friendly features that the DA-10A shares with the DA-10. Live view images can now be enlarged up to 23 times while still retaining high definition, letting you focus accurately on very small objects such as stars or planets. Electronic front curtain sync for reducing internal mechanical vibrations and an amazing 36 megapixel sensor that provides huge resolution while still allowing the photographer the ability to shoot at high ISO sensitivities with low noise. For photographers who want a full frame DSLR that's designed to shoot astronomical subjects, the DA-10A is the best choice. If you want to know more about the DA-10A, please go to Nikon.ca.